All right, thank you, John. If you're struggling to keep your lawn looking good while complying with the drought water restrictions, there is hope. News Channel 3 reporter Elise Martinez shows us one option you may have overlooked. There's relief for homeowners with grass that's withered in the drought. It comes in the form of a non-toxic, vegetable-based turf dye. I have kind of a secret sauce that I've added to my formula so that it does look really, really natural. Carrie McCoy is a professional lawn painter working in Santa Barbara, Ventura, and L.A. counties. And her business is booming. Instead of, you know, one call a week, it started being two, three, four calls a day. Lawn painting first took off during the housing crisis several years ago, when foreclosed homes needed curb appeal quickly. The drought is bringing it back as an alternative to planting synthetic grass or native vegetation. As a community, we're all uh, suffering from the drought, and um, you got to do what you got to do. If you're a do-it-yourselfer, a similar type of paint is now in stock at stores like the Santa Barbara Home Improvement Center. So it doesn't kill your lawn, so if it's still trying to grow, you can have it green without killing what's trying to come back. And it's cheap. You'll pay about $25 to spray 1,000 square feet. It's also easy. You can put this on a attachment for your garden hose. It holds a quart in that attachment, so you can just walk out and spray the whole lawn. The paint is safe for kids and pets, too. Actually, your neighbors will love it, you'll love it, and you know you're saving water. In Santa Barbara, Elise Martinez, News Channel 3.